Well, you might say it's a hair-raising study. It's come out regarding the cleanliness of facial hair. Yes, a New Mexico TV station swabbed the beards of several men and found that they were as dirty as a toilet. Fox 7's Noel Newton joins us in the studio with that. Noel. Beards are making a comeback. They were really popular, say, 30 years ago. Even this guy, Mike Warren, had one. Mike, just how dirty was that thing? Clean as a whistle. A new study found fecal matter in them. The members of the Austin Facial Hair Club are beard experts. Shampoo, condition it, um, use a boar bristle brush to like, brush it out. My upper lip hasn't seen the light of day in 30 years. Jackie Ellison is the reigning British national champion for handlebar mustache. So it's cool. My grandmother thinks it's cool. I think it's cool. I Thanks. love it. It's true, ladies have a thing for beards. But what a TV station discovered in Albuquerque may make the hair on the back of your neck stand up. A reporter swabbed a few bearded men in a lab tested the samples. They found bacteria comparable to what is on toilets or in feces. Honestly, I wasn't surprised. Stylist Kristen Baker tames the messiest of facial hair at Bird's Barbershop on South Congress. I've found anything from like feathers from say their pillow to stickier things and I'm like where were you last night? Usually involves 6th Street. You get to a point where you're just so used to it you're like okay just comb that right out. <laughs> When men come in with less than perfect hygiene, she makes sure to counsel them. You gotta treat your beard like you treat your hair. It's literally just another part of your face. So shampoo it, condition it, comb it daily. I make them able to get dates. That's what I do. <laughs> the Austin Facial Hair Club members doubt the validity of the study and with only a handful of samples, who wouldn't? Nothing really to take to heart. I mean. You know, that kind of bacteria is everywhere. Just like anything else, you got to keep yourself clean. Although these men take great pride in their facial grooming, they admit things can get messy. Oh, I have found some snack food when I've been watching TV. And when that happens, they are sure to clean it up one way or another. Um, depends on how hungry I am. On occasion. <laughs> <laughs> that means yes. <laughs> I mean, it's mine. So the study has already been refuted. Apparently the bacteria that was found normally live in the intestines. So Mike, how clean was your beard? Um, I just still can't believe that's you. I can't believe that either. That's, but how long ago was that? That was, pro that was Spain, probably 1985, 86 maybe. I Did nailed you? it 30 years ago. Yeah, there you go. Very good, yes. Wow. They probably had a little bit of chorizo in oh, there. And... Okay, now we got to get to weather. Thank we you, have... Noel. <laughs> Thanks.